There are basically three important ingredients that leads to some success in public service. Mm -hmm. Number one, you have to have a reputation for total integrity. Mm -hmm. Secondly, you have to have a reputation for hard work. And last, mm -hmm. and it's very important, you have to have a capability of getting good people to work with you. If we can stimulate good people to serve in government, I think that's a great tribute to the school. When I came here on my job interview, I was so impressed with how engaged the students are. They were engaged in the classroom, they're engaged in the community, they're engaged in the policy process, and it just energizes me to work with students who want to go into the world and make a positive difference. I remember coming to Spring Preview Weekend after I got accepted into Ford and just feeling so excited because I had this feeling of these are my people and uh, this is where I belong and this is the right fit for me. So right now the world of public policy, especially here in the United States, is messy and it's volatile and we need leaders who not only understand quantitative measures of policy but who can communicate those ideas well and the Ford School is a place where you can learn to do those things. Within the public service sector it is easy to get jaded when tackling um, difficult public policy issues, but being part of a cohort that's very supportive and very inspiring helps me push on forward and continue my dreams. We do feel like a community. The students are really engaged, want to make the world a better place. Our faculty are engaged in some really interesting research, and the staff help both the students and the faculty make their dreams come true. The Ford School's mission is helping improve people's lives, and we do that by teaching students a toolkit that is really versatile and really powerful. And so a gift to the Ford School enables um, young people to have the skills to go out in the world and make a difference. Seeing so many alumni and friends of the school get excited about helping students to be able to earn their degrees was just wonderful and a really special part of the campaign for me. You know, I'm investing in future leaders who are, are dedicated and have the ability to solve some of our world's uh, most pressing challenges. The Bonnet Foundation Fellowship that I received has been really instrumental in my success as a state legislator. I am currently a Yenching Scholar at Peking University in Beijing, China. But while I was still at the University of Michigan, I co-founded an organization called We Listen. Jim Hudak's gift allowed We Listen to host a conference this fall which brought Bill Crystal and Neera Tandon to the Ford School's campus and we are excited to keep growing with the help and support of the Ford School. The Wiser Family Fund has given Ford School students chances to get overseas and experience international policy practice firsthand through internships, through overseas courses, and other experiences that help launch them into careers in international affairs. The gifts that, that are given to the Ford School uh, to help support student learning go a long way. They help us do some really incredible things, and I think for a lot of people, they wouldn't be here without them. The Rieger Fellowship let me go to Washington, D.C. for the first time and work, which was something I didn't think I was going to be able to do, and it helped me to navigate my way into a space where I'd been wanting to work for a long time. It turns out I'm very passionate about. It's really important to me to have a life of public service and to specifically support communities. So receiving the Gerald R. Ford Fellowship has allowed me to really uh, maximize my academic experience here. I've been really lucky to not have to worry about finances and so I've been able to devote all of my energy and attention to classes and really get the most intellectually out of my experience here. Yeah, so through the Bonnet Fellowship I was able to do a summer internship with the City of Detroit's Planning and Development Department. In my work with the Planning Department I did a lot of outreach and engagement with residents who are working to create change in their neighborhood and drive strategic investment. I really hope to take the skills and experiences that I've learned here at the Ford School to um, work with disadvantaged communities to make sure that they um, have equal access to opportunity. The experiences that I gained through the fellowship program will stay with me throughout my career and I'm very grateful for having had those opportunities. The new Wiser Diplomacy Center is going to position UM to be the place uh, in the central United States to study diplomacy and one of the leading centers for the study and practice of diplomacy in the country. The Victors for Michigan campaign has been a huge success for the entire Ford School community. It's enabled us to help our students with fellowships and internships. It's expanded our programmatic activity. 
It's deepened our faculty's ability to engage in cutting-edge research, and it's made us able to have a much bigger impact in the world. It's also setting the stage for incredible growth and opportunity for the Ford School in the years to come. Working with our donors has been really great, a real privilege since I've been here at the Ford School. They've been so successful in their own careers, and now they're working with us to make the world a better place. I'm just deeply grateful to them. Thank you for your support. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your support. Thank you.